G'day everyone and welcome to another one of my Star Wars display videos. I'm going to give you a look at um, an episode 1 theme display now. And these, as you can see these are all the Gungans, Gungan warriors, and a couple of their vehicles. We've got the ammo wagon there. And also we have Jar Jar. Uh, he's on top of an animal that's called a Kayadu. And that uh, strange looking creature there is called a Flumpuset. And down here we've got a couple of Power of the Jedi from 2000 Gungans. It's Captain Tarples from 1999, the Episode 1 range. That Gungan's from the Legacy Collection, and the one on the end. He's also a Power of the Jedi Gungan. That Gungan's holding a horn, which is used during battle to give certain signals, like retreat. That's known as an Electropole, what Captain Tarples is holding. And those things they're holding in their hands I think are called Atlatl. Swing around here and give you a different angle of this ammo wagon. That figure there is not removable. I mean half the figure really. The um, Flumpuset does come apart, you can just lift off that part there and the animal stands by itself, separate from the ammo wagon. That's a um, firing weapon there on top, just push that button there for it to fire. And there's a spare energy ball in the back here of the wagon, which opens up. Put a couple in there, I guess. Figures at the side here. Boss Ness and Jar Jar. I like that figure. Probably need um, a few more Gungans to make this scene look a little better. We definitely get a couple more of the Legacy Collection ones. Now there is another um, creature or um, you know that in the Battle of Naboo, the shield generator that protects them all. In the Trade Federation Army. This set is called um, well, it's a shield generator Gungan shield generator with a Gungan warrior in it, and the creature's called a Fambar. Like they're about hundred dollars back in ninety nine, so I imagine on eBay it'd probably be even more than that now. And pretty damn hard to track down. I don't think they'd be coming up too often. I don't think Hasbro got any plans to re-release them. 
even though the 3D movies just come out, there will be a few things re-released. I look forward to seeing those. I look forward to seeing the 3D version of The Phantom Menace probably this week. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this little setup of episode one characters. Um, maybe I'll try and think of something else to do with an episode one theme shortly. Until then, all the best to you, and may the force be with you.